It's official! HBO Max launches May 27th, and I think for people like us, the best content is going to be the kids' content, which is really not just for kids. I love the Elmo uh, talk show. I watched that trailer by myself. I thought it was hilarious. I'm a big Cookie Monster fan because my favorite snack is cookies. That's my weakness. That's my kryptonite. So I loved it when Cookie Monster said, don't cookie explain cookies to me, to Jason Sudeikis. And, you know, I love the guests. Batman's going to show up. So I think that looks really fantastic. And you can watch it as late as you want to. <laughs> It'll just air earlier for small kids. But I think, you know, I think we love clever kids entertainment because that means everyone can enjoy it. And then now I'm going to watch this Looney Tunes trailer with you. And I have to tell you, this brings me back to when I was growing up and they had the Warner Brothers Studio Store. I don't know if any of you went to that store. It was amazing. It of course had a bunch of DC stuff. That's when the Batman animated series was airing. Uh, and they also had a lot of Looney Tunes stuff. That's how I got into Looney Tunes. I went in for the Batman stuff. I came out with a lot of Looney Tunes stuff uh, and Batman stuff. Uh, it was a great time to be a kid in New York City. They had F.A.O. Schwartz, uh, the, the Warner Brothers Studio Store and the Disney Store all within like a six, six or ten block radius on Fifth Avenue. It was pretty phenomenal. But I came to really like the Looney Tunes. My favorite was Marvin the Martian. They had like a, a 3D show that like it was in the it was in the top of the building. Uh, it was like a little 3D movie. Um, and I, I just really liked it. And I would get Christmas stuff with like Tweety Bird on it. Uh, and so it's really cool to see these characters come back with new cartoons. And it's weird that Disney would miss that opportunity with their own streaming service. And they don't have any new cartoons at launch. They still don't have any. Um, but I'm very excited to see new new Looney Tunes. All right, so let's, let's take a look. Here we go. Yeah, what's up, Jack? I'm the Piano Bell, Rabbissimo. I'm a-challenging you to an arm wrestling match, rabbit. I like the style of the animation. <laughs> oh, I like Roadrunner too. I did, I did! Love technology! <laughs> See, still adult too, though. Like, he operates on multiple levels, like a James Bond movie. <laughs> Hello, amusement park. No filthy animals on my ride. Oh, brother. <laughs> this place isn't kidding around. I am amused. <laughs> I love that. That's how I feel when I go to theme parks. I this in the name of Ah, Marvin. Bring the kids. <laughs> Just love these new streaming channels. Oh, meta humor. <laughs> Woohoo! This calls for a celebration. <laughs> That's a great tagline. That looks like a lot of fun. I think that looks excellent. I wonder how many they'll have. I wonder, uh, I don't know if I want to binge those or not. Uh, I don't want to run out of them. Uh, but yeah, to me so far, those are these are the two shows that I'm the most excited about. Uh, and there is that nostalgia factor too, which is really great. Um, so what do you think? What do you think of HBO Max? Uh, what do you, what do you, what shows do look the best to you? Uh, share your thoughts down below. Thanks for watching with me. And of course, as always, you can check out some more videos right now.